Are you getting low FPS or stutters in your games? What if I told you the fix isn't new hardware, but hidden Windows settings most people never touch? I tested the best Windows optimizations pros use to boost FPS and smooth gameplay. Stick around, because by the end of this video, your games will feel faster, smoother, and more responsive than ever. Let's get started. Gear Up Booster is a great tool that helps reduce your ping while playing games, and it works with both wired and wireless connections. Download it safely from the official website using the link in the description, and enjoy with lower ping. Step 1. Disable background apps to free up system resources. Open the Start menu and type Edit Group Policy into the search bar. Click on Edit Group Policy from the search results to open the Group Policy window. Once inside, navigate to Computer Configuration, Administrative Templates, Windows Components, App Privacy. In this section, find the option, Let Windows Apps Run in the Background and double-click on it. By default, it's set to Not Configured, which allows apps to run freely in the background. To stop them, select Enabled, and then under Default for All Apps, choose Force Deny from the drop-down menu. Click Apply, and then OK to save your settings. This will prevent unnecessary apps from running in the background which means more resources for Fortnite and other games, resulting in a smoother experience without lag or delays. Step two, unlock all CPU cores to boost Fortnite performance. You can download all the files in one pack directly from my official website. I've added the safe link in the description for you. Next, we're going to unlock all of your CPU cores, ensuring your computer's brain is using its full power to run Fortnite at its best. For this, we'll use a free tool called Park Control. Start by downloading and installing Park Control on your PC then open it. You'll be presented with several options and sliders. At the top, select the Bitsum Highest Performance Power Plan. This plan ensures that your CPU is running at full strength all the time, which is ideal for gaming. Now adjust the following settings one by one. Parking AC, set to 100% and turn it off. Parking DC, set to 100% and turn it off. Frequency Scaling AC, set to 100% and turn it off. Frequency Scaling DC, set to 100% and turn it off then scroll down and find Bitsum Dynamic Boost. Turn this setting on. What this does is it temporarily turns off unused CPU cores when your PC is idle, but reactivates them immediately when you start playing Fortnite or any other demanding game. This ensures your CPU always delivers peak performance when you need it the most. Now open your Windows Power Options and double check that Bitsum Highest Performance is selected as your active plan. Also, confirm that CPU parking and frequency scaling are set to 100% for both AC, plugged in, and DC, battery. Click Make Active and apply to save everything. Once these changes are made, your CPU will run at full power when you play Fortnite, making sure your game is smooth with faster builds, quicker response times, and better overall performance, even on older or lower spec computers. Step 3. Boost Windows Performance Using Chris Titus Tech Utility You can download all the files in one pack directly from my official website. I've added the safe link in the description for you. For this, we'll use a powerful tool called Chris Titus Tech Utility, which will remove unnecessary apps and services that use up performance and resources, helping your games run more smoothly. Find the FPS Boost Pack folder and open it. Inside, you'll see a text file containing some code. Copy everything from that file. Next, open the Windows search bar, type PowerShell, right-click it, and choose Run as Administrator. This is an important step to ensure you have full system access. Paste the code you copied into PowerShell and press Enter. This will open the Chris Titus Tech Utility window. Once it's open, go to the Tweaks tab. You'll see two options, Minimal and Standard. The Minimal option removes only a few unnecessary features, while the Standard option goes deeper, removing even more background tasks for better performance. Choose whichever option suits your preference. The tool will automatically create a restore point before it makes any changes, so if something goes wrong, you can easily undo everything. After selecting your tweak mode, click Run Tweaks, wait for it to finish, and then close the app. These optimizations will free up RAM, reduce CPU load, and make Windows run faster overall. This gives Fortnite more system resources to work with, improving performance and reducing lag. In this step, I'm going to show you a reliable tool that can help you get more stable ping while gaming. First, head over to the official Gear Up Booster website using the link in the description and download the tool. After downloading, install it on your PC. Once it's installed, open the Gear Up Booster interface. The first thing you'll need to do is log in using your Facebook or Google account. On the Home tab, you'll see all the games installed on your PC. If you switch to the Games tab, you can also browse thousands of supported titles for optimization. To optimize your network and FPS, go back to the Home tab and select the game you want to boost. For example, Fortnite. Click the Boost button and Gear Up will begin optimizing your connection. It will also recommend the best server for you. Next, you'll be asked to choose a server region. For the best connection, select the nearest server to your location. In my case, the Middle East server works best. After that, you can close the window and move to the end tab. 
where you'll see a list of available servers in your chosen region. You can either pick the nearest one yourself or let GearUp automatically select the best option. I suggest leaving it on automatic for the most stable results. Finally, close the setup window and launch your game directly from GearUp Booster. This process helps reduce ping, improve stability, and make your overall gameplay experience smoother. Step 4. Make your RAM work better using ISLC for Fortnite. You can download all the files in one pack directly from my official website. I've added the safe link in the description for you. Let's now focus on optimizing your system memory, RAM, using a tool called ISLC, Intelligent Standby List Cleaner. This tool helps clear memory that Windows reserves but doesn't actually use, freeing up space for Fortnite and reducing stutters. After installing ISLC, open the program. You'll see your total memory displayed in megabytes. Take that number, divide it by 2, and enter it in the box labeled Free Memory is Lower Than. For example, if you have 16,000 megabytes of RAM, type 8,000. If you have 32,000 megabytes of RAM, type 16,000. Then enable these two options. Start ISLC minimized, so it runs quietly in the background. Launch ISLC on user logon, so it starts automatically with Windows. Next, on the right side, turn on timer resolution and set it to 0.50, which helps reduce latency. Set polling rate to 1000 milliseconds if you have a fast PC, or 10,000 milliseconds for older ones. Finally, click stop, then start, and then purge standby list. This clears unused memory, making sure Fortnite always has the resources it needs to run smoothly. Step 5. Fix keyboard input delay using filter keys setter for gaming. You can download all the files in one pack directly from my official website. I've added the safe link in the description for you. In fast-paced games like Fortnite, even the smallest input delay can affect your performance. Windows sometimes automatically adds a delay to your keyboard inputs through something called filter keys. To fix that, we'll use a small tool called filter keys setter. Once you open the program, you'll see options to control how quickly your keyboard responds. Set ignore under to zero milliseconds. This completely removes any delay before your key presses are detected. Next, set repeat delay to 130 milliseconds, which controls how long it waits before repeating a key when you hold it down. Finally, set repeat rate to 10 milliseconds, so repeated key presses happen as quickly as possible. After applying these settings, your keyboard will feel almost instantaneous. This tweak is especially useful for FPS games or competitive titles like Fortnite, where every millisecond counts. You'll notice your controls feel more responsive, making your gameplay smoother and faster. Step 6. Disable memory compression to reduce stuttering. Open the Start menu, type PowerShell, then right-click Windows PowerShell and choose Run as Administrator. A blue command window will open with full system access. Copy the command from the video description, paste it into PowerShell, and press Enter. This command disables memory compression. If memory compression was already disabled, nothing will change, so it's perfectly safe. Once the command finishes, close PowerShell. With memory compression turned off, Windows handles your RAM more directly, which leads to smoother gameplay, better frame consistency, and fewer stutters during Fortnite sessions. If this guide helped you boost FPS, fix lag, and make Fortnite smoother, make sure to like this video, subscribe to the channel, and share it with your friends who love gaming.